Hey guys, how's it going? Whoop whoop, what up? So, let's go. I want some breakfast this morning. And I got someone sent 20 bucks to my PayPal, which I do appreciate. I said, go have some breakfast. I said, okay, I'll probably a brunch, a lunch. I said, do you want it broadcast? He said, no need, go enjoy breakfast. I said, okay, I'm going to enjoy breakfast. Uh, I left the phone in the car. So Jen tried to call me an hour ago and I asked her and she says, I don't remember why I called you. I said, gee, thanks. So it happens. Uh, I don't know, maybe Jack in a Box for a cheeseburger and fries. Something, you know, not that much that I need. I don't know. So, let's go. There's been a influx which I appreciate to the donations but apparently there are some people on Studio 17 that aren't very well liked and so if I'm broadcasting they message me and I have you know a couple of phones tied into my PayPal hey here's some money uh, do this because he's gonna do this and just do that this that and the other thing so I said, thought about it, so okay. So if I'm broadcasting and I go into someone's studio or whatever, you know how that works. If it's someone that people don't like, I mean, I get people saying, well, do this to DJ Zombie. I send the money back to him and say, go suck a dick. Okay, a zombie is a friend of mine. Okay, I'm not going to do that to him. Timekeeper is a friend of mine. Nightmare is a friend of mine. So these things happen. So let's see. 10 15 a.m. Sunday. Uh, tomorrow I have a regular doctor appointment. Hopefully, this doctor remembers I need my medication. Because, oh yeah, I'll send it. He never sent it brand new doctor Ooh. now let you go this camera stand I'm using right now as you can only see from here to here it is because of the uh, I took Gorilla Glue and I put it on top of the uh, the stand the camera stand and it took a while, but it's not doing what it's supposed to do. Alright, so, here we go. I need all these boats heading home. Uh, lower the window down. So let's see. Uh... Wow, just for a sandwich, it's almost like 10 bucks nowadays. I don't know. I usually like the egg rolls, but I don't know anymore. I get the combo for the jumbo jack with cheese. It's about ten bucks. Let me find my wallet. Got it. The seat belts in the way. Oh, they're still having breakfast. Luckily, Jack in the Box is seven days a week. Breakfast is served twenty-four-seven. Got it. Let's plug it back in. The seat belt. There we go. Oh, 
What kind of jack-a-box can we get for you today? Uh, jumbo jack with cheese, uh, no lettuce, and no, okay. no onions, large fry, large diet coke, light ice. Okay, any tacos or anything else today? No. Uh, let's crack down the screen, 8 at the window. Alright, thank you. You're welcome. Alright, let's see. Here's 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, Ten is eleven bucks. They might need the ones we don't know. We'll find out. Twenty put back in my wallet. Ugh. I think it's seven and change. So we got the eight right there. Wait, yeah, I thought it was a two dollar bill because of that. See it? It's a five, but if you put it that way, it looks like almost like a two dollar bill. So I'm looking at the camera, it's like, what the? And I looked right here and I see the five backwards. Gasoline, California, right here where I'm at, guys. Diesel is 409, right? Then it's regular, which is 389. But if I go a little bit over the bridge into Arizona, it's 19 was it 189 a gallon? California's fucked up. And as soon if they go all electrical, they're gonna lose all that money from the gas, from the taxes and shit. So that means what? They're going to tax you and tax you on everything. Yeah, I want to move out of here before I end up being 200. Yes, I said 200. 200 years of age. I'm planning to live to be a burden. On who? On society. Why am I going to be a burden on society? Why not? These guys got to stay off my ass. They keep pulling up and they shouldn't. They're like this far from my bumper. If they get too close and piss me off, I'll say stay off my motherfucking bumper. So yeah. Oh, I wanted to say uh, thank you to, uh, wow. All the people donating, which I do appreciate. Um, you don't have to donate. You know, like I said, um, you never know. I do appreciate it, though. I think this here is infected, guys. See how it's puffy? And this one isn't. Yeah. So this ear is infected right there, the ear lobe. Here we go. Need to show you again. <sighs> Definitely need to shave again. I remember I worked four hours at one place doing security, then another job was four hours at another place. And, um,
another job was eight hours. I usually pull 12 to 16 hours a day. Go home, go to sleep, unless it was a job site that actually had a cot. Basically, it was a bed so you could sleep there and just change and just go straight to work or you could just hang around what you're going to do before time. But you had to be working within that pow part. So if it was a four hour to six to eight, you can sleep. If it was 12, you had to go home. But if you were working, you got more things like pulling 16 hours a day or 20 because they'll allow you they're shorthanded. They would bring you cash instead of your check. Hello. That should be nine. Here you go. Any sauce for today? Nah. I still have the leftover sauce you gave me that one day. Mm -hmm. there you go. Thank you. All right, thank you. <laughs> we got the fries. Guys, I love fries. But I love onion rings more, you know that, right? <coughs> so yeah. And right now all these school buses are coming down because kids got softball league. I don't know how they're getting by the coronavirus bullshit a softball league when they're all crowded in a freaking bus. Self. Just bury the bodies deep. If it's a cop you're burying deep, make sure you cut off his head, his fingers, his DNA. Cut off everything there is. His DNA is his name. -o. So I got my food. I'll be heading home. It's a short trip. Very short. So, doctor tomorrow, and then, um, that's the highlight of the whole freaking day. When you're disabled, sitting home doing shit, there ain't shit. So you're on the computer, or you're gaming with your friends, or, I don't know. Next lane. I didn't get me a drink, I should've. I should've got me a drink. Wait, I did, didn't I? Yeah, I did. I forgot it's next to me. I should have got a drink. I did. My drink is right here next to me. It's my diet uh, Coke or Dr. Pepper, whatever you want to call it. How they are, you know, nowadays. I don't know.
Yes, we're home. We're coming in through the driveway. Good Coke. When your mouth's dry, yeah. But I do have some like Hawaiian punch and stuff in the kitchen. So if I want to do watery based stuff without the sugar, yeah. Well, this has without sugar too. Doesn't always mean it is. Because I got a drink one day from Jack in the Box that was supposed to be Diet Coke and it tasted too good. Then I asked him, I said, is this Diet Coke? Oh no, it's regular. I said, yeah, but I asked for Diet. Mm. Ah, ice cold. Talk to you guys later. Much clown love. Boop, boop. Peace. Believe in something without belief, there's nothing. Just don't force your belief on somebody else. Take care.